freshman. Yes, sir. First reception, a touchdown catch in the end zone. Tell me about the play. Man, it felt good. I'm, I'm glad I had my hands on the right way, so I called it. It was a good feeling. Oh, I was pumped up. Oh yeah, I was ready to come out here. What's some tail? And overall, what how, what would you say about your performance, the overall team performance out here tonight? Oh, we did pretty good. We just got some things to work on, but it was a good win overall, though. We knew it would be a big game. We knew it would be a physical game. Coach Braswell and their squad, I mean, they are who we thought they would be on film, and they gave us a great challenge. They brought a lot of pressure, and our guys just responded to the bell. We knew if we weathered the storm in the first quarter, got our bearings a little bit, some of our younger guys would, would stop spinning and start playing more football, and so we got a little bit more um, into the run game, and it was able to pop some creases there, make some plays, and so I'm excited about how we responded. Where last year we kind of stayed on the floor, this year we got up off the floor. So that's a sign of growth, and that's what you want to see as a head coach. Your quarterback had a nice game, two touchdowns, runs one in, and then throws it to the freshman. But just talk about that play <laughs> and and the play of your quarterback tonight. No, it, it's that group, that experience of Jaden. We called a timeout, got him on the sideline. We actually talked through that play and put that receiver in that position to go try to make that play because of his speed. And he's just a freshman, but we got to trust those guys to make plays. And we felt he's been making those plays in practice. Let's give him a shot here. And Jaden stepped in the pocket, made a beautiful throw. And you know that's what you expect from a senior leader. Jarrell Boulder, he's a specimen. He's one of those guys that's put together that has a lot of twitch to him, and he has a ton of upside. And he's just now beginning to understand what the expectations look like at the high school level. And so, you know, Boulder made a huge play, and he's made plays like that for us in practice. And we're going to have to count on those freshmen again, just like we did last year. And I think we got a nice mix of senior, senior group and some older guys that are contributing now. And so I think, that, you know, I mean, we keep on saying the future's bright here at the Hive, and there's no doubt about it. And the last one, your defense, really very impressive tonight, really closing down the gaps pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. Talk about the, the play of the front line and overall defensive play. We've been bragging and we've been talking about how good our front front line is between those backers and the, and, and the front D linemen right there. And they just continuously attack, and there's such a level of competition. Um, Aiden stepping up, and then you guys, brother Caden, and Ephraim Dees is emerging and coming along, and Christian Hammonds has been lights out all, all camp, and then you throw in um, someone like Zach Barber, who's starting to get it and understand that he's ready to take off. And then on the back end, we had some guys make some plays. And Josh Rivera, another guy that didn't play for us last year, young sophomore, he made an interception for us. Um, and we talk about all the time having a sense of pride and storming, and our defense is starting to take a little bit of that ownership with it. So I'm excited about see how we grow from this this game and, and move forward. Yeah, just to, just want to attack on one last one. I mean, that defensive stand right there was very impressive as well. Got to be a big confidence builder for those guys to keep them out of the end zone. Yeah, that's the importance that we stress is closing out drives. Um, you know, and it's, you look at the scoreboard and guys can get relaxed and stuff. No, we want to be a dominant team for four quarters, and that's what we preach with ever how long it takes. And to see them make that stand in the fourth quarter with a little under two minutes in the game um, to help seal that and, you know, alleviate the pressures having to get a hands team on there, that's the growth we're excited about. And, you know, we're taking those steps and we're building that on um, the program. And um, I'm excited about direction and our defense is going to pave the way.